hi everyone welcome back to my channel so today we'll be talking about one of the material i use and i'm still using as a shoemaker and i also use as a beginner so we're talking about nora today that like the soul the soul we use so first thing for this is called nigerian nora we call this nigerian nora it comes i have seen brown i have seen black and i have seen this and coffee brown for the nigerian nora yes uh, i don't know which color you have in your in wherever you are but this is one i've seen nigerian nora well this is called the local nora used for half so especially for our heel half so heel you can use this one most especially for repairs that's what we use um this um local nora for now this is another design for nigerian nora it comes in different design but they will always tell you what it is if you ask ask them so this is the this is the, this is the other color for the nigerian nora yes this is it and the other ones too so i think some come fluffy and some are strong I don't really use Nigerian Nora per se because people said it's not, people always say it's not strong. But this brown one particularly, people have really told me that uh, it is strong and um, it has a very durable lifespan. So I shouldn't be scared, but I always prefer the foreign Nora. Now this is called the foreign Nora 3 nora 3 we have nora 4 and nora 3 and they come in like-minded designs like this for nora 3 and 4 so don't confuse them for the numbers anyway the numbers matter a lot because nora 4 is usually thicker but the way materials are right now of course god will help us because sometimes you cannot even differentiate between nora 3 and 4 but that's it guys so we have the local sorry the plain nora Plain Nora 3. I have seen the brown and I have seen black. It's black and brown. That's what I work with. Now, this is called, they call it chingom. Chingom crepe. And it is used for sew too. See, eh? this thing is so light and very flexible. And it's so costly. I don't know why. Yeah, very, very costly. So, it's like 800 Yes, 800, but the other ones are 600 and so. While this one, they call it Tiles Nora. I don't know. I think it's because of the way it looks. So they call it, because of all those things on it, they call it Tiles Nora. It comes in different colors though, but this is the ones I was able to capture for the Tiles Nora. And this is also the Chingom um, no, right, I just escaped. Then we are talking about the, um, they call this figure eight. And they use it mostly for Birkenstock shoes, for Betula. So they divide it. Yes, so one pair of it is per pair. I don't know how much it is, though. But I think it's 800 or so. 800, 900 is the price. So it's called figure eight, especially for um, Betula. Baking stock is what we use that figure eight for, and that is it, guys. For the sole, I usually use for my work, but particularly, I like I said, I always use Nora three and Nora four. Then I go for the figure eight too. I've not made Betula for some time, so really, I don't know the price, and you know, prices change a lot. So guys, that's it for our tutorial today. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos and notifications. Bye guys.